As it has been the case with most political parties in Nigeria, the Alliance for New Nigeria, ANN, is battling with its own internal crisis. With a build-up to the 2019 elections and political parties holding their respective conventions and primaries, the National Convention of the Alliance for New Nigeria saw the emergence of Mr. Feladurutui as the party's presidential candidate. More than anything else, we also have the right values. And those values are the things that Nigerians are looking for now. Not the, not, not the Nigerians and the, the old system that has brought us to where we are today. Nigerians are looking for a new system that will produce a new Nigeria. And ANN, Alliance for New Nigeria, has that system and we saw it today. It's a transparent system. It's a system of integrity and a system that delivers excellence. Duro Toye's emergence doesn't seem to sit well with some members of the party, as his rival for the position, Mr. Benga Hashim, is visibly absent. It was later learned that the other faction of the party, to which Mr. Hashim belongs, had planned to hold its own convention. Mr. Emmanuel Dania insists that he is the legally recognized chairman of the party and that the convention was held in line with INEC's requirements. Regardless of what the news is on the outside, um, that I have been suspended or by a group of renegades, in my opinion, uh, does not stand. I am the one who is recognized by INEC as the national chairman. We went ahead uh, as stipulated in the notice we've given to INEC. We had INEC officials, five INEC officials, that were at the convention to see the transparency. He says the party is, however, open to reconciliation. The ideals of our party is totally different, so we're very open to reconciliation. We're very open to ensuring that um, we, can, we can move forward uh, with this. However, we have no intention of changing whatever the outcome of the uh, presidential primaries uh, that was held 29th of September. That is unchangeable. The Alliance for New Nigeria was registered earlier this year. Political observers believe it is rather too early for a party this young to be embroiled in this magnitude of crisis, especially with the elections around the corner.